the employees versus businesses. And when they mm. set up rules for taxes, they put you in one of two categories. If you are an employee, that means you virtually have no tax deductions. As a matter of fact, when the 2018 tax code was, was released, they okay. took away mileage, they took away all kinds of stuff from employees. But businesses, mm. if you have a home-based business, that means your name and your social security number. You could mm -hmm. be a DJ, a Uber driver, a makeup artist, a, mm. a, a, a soon-to-be rapper. You could be a right. Mary Kay lady, an Avon. As long as you got when that tax you, ID number. You don't even have to have a tax ID number. See, oh. the new care, you don't need, all you need is your name and your social security number. You have okay. a home-based business, and then you have 475 tax deductions. Now, this is what everybody got to understand. You got to do three things if you want to have some money. You got to mm. spend less money. You mm -hmm. got to get more money. But mm -hmm. the more money you make, the more the IRS will take, okay? That's right. The more you make, the more they take. Look at Antoine Walker, the NBA player. He had a $110 million contract, but he had $55 million in taxes because nobody trained him. He talks about it openly. Mm. So now you got to get your money back. What do I mean by get your money back? If you went to the grocery store and bought $500 worth of groceries and ate all your groceries, and next week the grocery store manager said, come back and get your money, you would go back and get your money. Well, that's mm. what the IRS says. When you have a business, you get to use your cell phone. And the IRS says, come get your money back. When you travel for business, the IRS says, come get your money back. You have children. Children are expensive. The IRS says you can hire your kids to work in your home-based business. They can file. They can sweep the floor. They can take out the trash from your home-based business. And you can make your child up to $12,000 and get your money back. So that's why we got to have a home-based business. All my children work for me, thanks to Family Hustle. You know what I'm saying? Which, you know, exactly. on every Monday's on VH1. So all my children and my wife, for that matter, are employees. And the things, you know, that I am able to now write off uh, for them are things that probably, you know, may or may not have already been being done. But because now we're working together and, you know, under the business codes, we're able yep. to deduct so much more, which which helps us a lot. It helps out. It's, this is the game changer because, like, I'm dealing with a lot of, like, celebrities and Hollywood people, like writers, people behind the scenes, and they're making some nice money. Like, they're making a couple hundred thousand. They're getting a, to, close to a million or over a million. But when they make more money, they owe the IRS so much money. And it's simple things like what you just said. I'm just like you. My whole family works, but everybody's on payroll, okay? So when we right. take a trip, it's a business trip. I tell people, don't go on vacations. Don't go on family unions. Take a business, business trip. trip. The IRS says, yeah, you can still go to Disney World. You can still go to the uh, park where they burn not, up the rib tip. Not family and, vacation, and though. We're on a business trip. That's right. So all That's you right. people out here getting, all, all of you ladies who getting flued at, and all you gentlemen who flying ladies at, discuss a little bit of business while you on this here, you know, excursion of yours. You know what I'm saying? <laughs> exactly. Exactly. <laughs> you know what I'm saying? So, Do it in the name of philanthropy, at least. So, but listen to this. So, Regular employees, so if you don't have a home-based business, and to me, everybody should have a home-based business, everybody, even the kids. So right. my youngest daughter been working for me since she was six. She's 18. I learned this from Sandy Bakken. He used to work for the IRS as a, a, a he was the attorney for the IRS training the auditors. He mm -hmm. left the IRS, and now all he does is train people. So I've been following him for about 12 years, learning everything, learning the tax code. Do you right. know... When you have a business, you have about 475 tax deductions. Everything from your meals, when you buy your personal items, when you travel, your dry cleaning, when you fly, when you, I mean, everything. And employees only have about eight deductions. So that's where people are losing a lot of their money and they're leaving money on the table. So you got to get your money back. You got to get your mm -hmm. money back. I mean, this is all incredible information, man. I hope y'all got your notepads out, man. Hope you got your bowl and your spoon out, man, because I think this is the kind of information, you know, this is the kind of information we all need to absorb because these are the things, these are the key, the key uh, uh, pivotal things that they're keeping from us, man, you know. But they're hiding them in books. So anytime we want to pick up Ooh, the right book, you preaching. You, you preaching. can get this information.